we will start practical number 2 of qgis click on the layer click on add layer then click add raster layer click on three dots click on practical number 2 then select a now select the gldes 00g60 dot asc file open add now again select three dots now select the gldes 90g60 dot asc then again open add close now we will change the color right click on 90 g60 right click afterwards properties click on the symbology render type single band pseudo color interpolation should be linear color ramp click on the small arrow all color ramps select last one now change the values so i am changing the values 0 sixty one twenty one eighty two forty I'm not changing the labels name you want to change you can change there is a plus symbol which means add and another minus symbol means delete then click on apply then okay now you have seen there is a color change in a map now we will calculate so click on the raster raster calculator double click on first then operator there should be minus again click on second one double click so now output we should save this file so click on three dots i given a file name as output so now only spelling mistake is there then save then okay you have seen now this color chain again so right click on output and click on properties click on symbology render type should be single band pseudo color and interpolation should be discrete now we will change the value and as well as label value first value should be minus 20000 so i am also changing the color i am giving black and label name should given giving the no data second value i am giving minus 10 and changing color to red then okay then i am giving label name as negative third value giving 10 and changing color to yellow then okay and giving label name as neutral again fourth or i mean changing the value as 6000 and again i'm changing the color to blue okay and and changing the label name as 
and giving label name as positive fourth row i am deleting this row by double click on minus then apply okay see now map has changed according to we are given a color now click on layer and click on add layer and click add raster layer click on the three dots now we will add a india map click on the c india c i have five pictures of india we have to add i add one again we have to add second india image third image add fourth image again add fifth image now close you have seen that uh, india the map is so now we will merge so click on the raster and click on miscellaneous and again click on merge click on the three dots select the india 1 2 3 4 5 then click on run now it is oh or again click on parameters then okay now we have to save this file so click on three dots in advanced parameter and we have to given file name as i am giving in small letter merge then save then again we have to run this file click on the run it's over now click on close now we will see a map right click on merge and zoom to layer small merge see now we will add a india boundary so to add a india boundary we have to click on the layer then click on add layer add vector layer click on the three dots and go to c in the admin boundary and click on the shp file and open close so now we will change the color so right click on it and click on the properties click on symbology and we will select a dark blue as a boundary then apply okay see there is showing a blue color in the boundary now click on the raster and click on extraction clip raster by mask layer and click on three dots where you we have saved the merge file click on that and open now scroll it go to advanced parameter clip to mask we have to save this file 
and I am saving this file as a clipped mask. So we have to show the India map clearly. And then click on run. It will take time. So clip mask will do. It will clip this some images which shows the perfect India. It will take some time. Click on the cl close. See, now India is seeing perfect map. Now I am saying this. Right to practical number two is completed.